All right, you got a good picture? All right, three, two, one. Hey everyone, Solar Steve back again. Today's little demonstration is on the Unirack solar mount kit, which we are using on this project to rack our solar modules. So this is a top clip method. And if you'll notice on the rail, this being the top of the rail, you can see that channel in there, okay? And what that's for is to accept a T-bolt which slips in the rail and allows it to be retained, okay? And then you would have either a center clip, which bonds two panels next to each other to the rail, or an end clip, which I have to get out of the box, but the idea is the panels go on, this slips down over the top, which is actually, in actuality, it'll be much higher depending on the thickness of the panel. And you just nut it on down. It's really simple. One of the other things we're going to be doing with this system, uh, something that was actually invented by Wiley Electric. Uh, they call it a WEEB. And it's actually an acronym for Wiley Equipment, Wiley Electric Equipment Grounding. Or something like that and it looks like this it's just this little bitty clip okay and then the idea is is that it sits down like this in the in the rail and you can see the little tabs on here and when you tighten this down it breaks through the anodized coating of the aluminum okay which gives you an effective ground bond so your panel would go up against this little ear this panel would go up, up against this little ear. Of course, you have to have your T-bolt in there. And then the whole thing sandwiches together and nuts down. And that complete makes your, your bond between panels to the rack. And of course, talking about grounding, you can also see right here, uh, these will be finished as the panels come across the rails, but these are ground lugs and it's required to have a ground bond between the splices. So you can see that I have a splice kit installed here, and right here is the seam, so I have to ground across the two pieces of racking in order to effectively ground the entire rack. And then over here you can see the bare copper wire going all the way down to the J-box. That So that, if that effectively takes the grounding all the way down to the inverter. So it's a real simple kit. It works real well. The one thing you have to remember with weaves when you're using weaves is you can only use them once. Okay, so if you ever had to take the panel off the rail, okay, you have to replace the weave with a new one. And that's just that's just cheap insurance to make sure you've got grounding. So Today's panel day, you can see that we're starting to lay our panels out. And uh, we'll give you an update soon. So for now, Solar Steve signing off.